clear up two misunderstandings that I get a lot of times from people when it comes to the Arc Flash sticker. I do a lot of training uh, throughout the Western United States for sometimes small engineering groups, large engineering groups, and there's always a misunderstanding. I want to clear, clarify both of those. It is not just a warning sticker. There's a general warning sticker art that says that there's someone can get shocked or injured working on a live electrical. That's not the Arc Flash sticker we're talking about. The Arc Flash sticker we're talking about actually has specific information on there so a person can make the right assessment and do their work safely that's on there. As you look at the sticker, you'll see that there are different things on there, components, so they know what the risk is and what level of protection and what their boundaries need to be. But I want to clarify that the sticker is not meant for everybody. If you've had an arc flash study done at your property, the sticker, just because it's there, doesn't mean anybody can access it. The sticker is meant for one specific group of people, and that's someone who's qualified. I know what you're thinking. I only hire qualified individuals to do my electrical. But the thing is, it's just, it's just not that they're qualified to do their task, but they're also qualified to work in an arc flash environment. So what does that mean? So when they come up to the sticker, that they know how to read the sticker. They know what the incident energy means. They actually have PPE gear with them, and they know to choose the proper level of protection when they're exposed to live electrical. They understand the boundaries, uh, the limited approaches. Uh, they know how to work safely to do their tasks when they're exposed to live electrical. See, if, if that's not the individuals you're allowing to work in your building, if that's not the individual you're allowing to open up the panel and do their work, then they're not qualified and that sticker's not meant for them. So just make sure that you understand that when somebody's gonna do work in your building, one, they're qualified to do their tasks, and second, they're qualified to do that task in an arc flash environment.